Hey guys, so thought I'd just let you know here today that today is an awesome day if you are looking for new firmwares for your new high-end Samsung phone that could be a Samsung Galaxy Note or could be a Samsung Galaxy S2. Yes, I know there's other phones out there, but today we got some official stuff by Samsung leaked. Uh, some new Android 4.0 ICS ROMs that got leaked. First of all, we got this new XXLPH firmware uh, for our Samsung Galaxy S2. And obviously this is a leaked one, you know, Samsung hasn't released it themselves, but it, it's leaked, it uh, has a build date in February, and we can see the progress, the, what Samsung is doing here with Android 4.0, uh, running their own touch with UI. So I made a video about that, so you can go ahead and check it out on my channel. Uh, but what also, what we got today was the first Galaxy Note Android 4.0 ICS ROM that got leaked. Uh, and there are two different versions. If you live in China, I don't think you live in China, but in China they have like a Galaxy Note that is being called the i9220. Uh, so we, we have a Chinese uh, version of the Galaxy Note firmware that got leaked. Uh, but I don't think most people will, will be interested in that. But if you have the GTN7000, which uh, like the most people do have, I don't think the AT&T uh, guys note is uh, that one, but I'm not sure. But uh, I at least have the N7000, and I think you know, like every European guy and like people in South Korea have the N7000. Uh, but we have a, another firmware, another guys note firmware for the N7000 that also got leaked. Based on Android 4.0.3, it's being called the N7000 XXLP1. Now, do you remember back in January, like in mid January, I made a video on this XXLP1 and XXLP2 firmware of Android 4.0 ICS for the Galaxy S2 that got leaked? So I think that that could be this could be an old one that they made for you know like back in January we don't know like the build date yet I assume but it has that kind of cool like 3D effect and we have a few pictures here now the reason why I'm not installing this on my Galaxy Note is because I love my Galaxy Note right now I can't run a stable or an, an unstable firmware I have so many pictures I have so many things on my Galaxy Note I don't want to reinstall them you know it, 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 my phone I use it all day long okay so I, I can't do anything or I can do something but I don't want to you know mess up my main phone because I really can't go back to a Galaxy S2 or a Galaxy Nexus after you've been after you've been having a Galaxy Note. You can't go back. Okay, so we have some pictures here at least, um, and I mean it, it looks kind of the same as uh, the one that I used to review the XXLPH for the Galaxy S2. Uh, but uh, here we can see the CSC file X XALP1. And then XXLP1 over there. Um, but yeah, Samsung is working on it. And hopefully we will get a release in March for both the Galaxy S2 and the Galaxy Note. But I'm pretty skeptical uh, about that, that we're going to get it for the Galaxy Note uh, that early. Because, uh, I mean, first, their like, first main focus right now seems to be working on the Galaxy S2 update. Uh, and then, you know, the Galaxy Note. And then uh, hopefully some other, you know, Galaxy S2 variants and everything that's out there. But yeah, some first pictures here. If you want to go ahead and download it, just go to samovel.com, go to the firmware page. And I will try to leave a link in the description to uh, the articles. Awesome. See you.